Good afternoon, meteorologist Jesse Kelly here in the Weather Center. I hope everyone's having a fantastic Sunday. Another hot afternoon through all the architects. Seeing thunderstorms beginning to build throughout portions of East Texas, even into Northwest Louisiana right now. Seeing temperatures here across Shreveport, into Texas, Canada, into the lower 90s. Seeing those winds out of the southwest at 5 to 10 miles an hour. 90s and 80s on the board right now. 90 degrees in the center, 8 degrees into Magnolia right now, and 94 degrees currently into Mount Pleasant. And again, thunderstorms are beginning to develop, especially across portions of northwest Louisiana. And you've seen a few thunderstorms developing west of McCurtain County to southeast Oklahoma. And again, we'll be watching a cold front work its way into the region as we get into the evening hours, into the overnight hours, into the first part of Monday morning. You see the thunderstorms are starting to develop towards the north. Of the region right now, you can see a lot of starting to get to get its act together, and there's a few severe thunderstorm warnings along that line. So we'll continue to watch this very carefully as we we'll see everything work its way from the north and down towards the south and east this evening to the overnight hours into Monday morning. So I'm telling you, kind of shows those thunderstorms slowly working its way towards the, uh, the south. So about 10 o'clock, we'll see those temperatures pretty much along the Interstate 30 corridor, and then by midnight, the line of thunderstorms work its way to about Shreveport or so, about one, two. 3 o'clock into the morning hours. Then maybe seeing a few more lingering showers across the I-30 quarter, and then everything works its way down towards Manny and Natchitoches around sunrise tomorrow morning, and we'll begin to see the rain and thunderstorms come to an end, still seeing a few lingering showers by the latter part of Monday morning, and we'll see all the rain move out of here by noon or so. It'll be a very cloudy uh, first part of the afternoon, then we'll continue to see those clouds on the decrease by the evening hours as we see those temperatures by Tuesday morning falling down to the 50s. So looking at a very beautiful afternoon for your Tuesday. Lots of sunshine. Temperatures not too bad, only to the 70s as we see those winds out of the northeast at 5 to 10 miles an hour. Now rainfall amounts between now into Tuesday. Some areas could see amounts anywhere between a half an inch to an inch of rain. Could see some higher totals than that, but again, we do need rain here into the Arctic, so that is opportunity of rain tonight into Monday, and then we'll see more thunderstorms as we get into uh, Thursday night into your Friday. So by 7 o'clock, we'll see temperatures into the 50s and 60s, 50s on the Interstate 30 corridor, much warmer towards Shreveport, down towards Manny and Nactus, where thunderstorms will still be ongoing. About the afternoon, again, we'll see those temperatures into the 70s, been by two o'clock, excuse me, by seven o'clock on Tuesday morning. Temperatures not too bad, feeling very comfortable, cool and crisp. We'll see temperatures by 7 a.m. to the lower to middle 50s. That feels a okay to me. And then by Tuesday afternoon, we'll see plenty of sunshine with temperatures going right back up into the 70s, rebounding into the 80s as we get into Wednesday. But again, looking simply a okay. Lots of sunshine. And finally, feeling like fall here into the architects. Well, for tomorrow, though, we'll see a temperature around 74 degrees. Thunderstorms are likely into the morning hours, giving way to clearing skies late. We'll see those winds out of the north at 10 to 15 miles an hour. Next seven days shows temperatures into the 70s for Tuesday, back up into the 80s for your Wednesday, also for your Thursday. Then we'll begin to see our next chance of showers and thunderstorms by next Friday. And again, some of those thunderstorms. Maybe on strong side, we'll keep our eyes out for that. That will drop temperatures down to the 40s and 50s by next weekend. With daytime highs by then back into the 60s and 70s. So over the next seven days, it looks as if right now we are done with the 90s. Finally, fall light temperatures are under the forecast. But again, looking at good rain chances for tonight. And again, Thursday night into the day on your Friday. 